In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create a proof sheet, which is basically one image per page using the print module in Lightroom. So I'm in the library module at the moment. I have my image selected that I would like to print to one page, and I'll select the print module here. Now currently, the uh, paper size that I have it's in landscape format, and because my photo is in portrait format, I want to change the orientation of the page. So I'm going to click on page setup here on the left, bottom left, and I'm going to change this so that it's in portrait mode. And you'll see that it changed the layout. Um, you can also look through these templates and you can also create your own templates if you end up using the print module quite frequently. Um, but for now, what I have selected is fine. So if you're not seeing one image per page, you have to make sure that you have single image slash contact sheet selected. You'll notice that if I select picture package, I get something different and custom package shows a different template. So I'm going to leave it on single image contact sheet. Um, rotate to fit. Because I already changed my paper orientation, um, rotate to fit doesn't change anything. But what this does is that um, it'll rotate your photo so that it best fits the background paper. Do not select zoom to fill because that ends up cropping your photo in order to fill the space. And if you want your original composition maintained, then you want to leave this unchecked. And down here, you can play around with the spacing. But because I want one full image um, as large as possible, I'm going to leave it like that. And I'm not going to print this particular image to my printer. Instead, I want to export it as a JPEG. So in the print job panel where it says print to in the drop down menu, if yours was already selected for printer, you want to select JPEG file. And then down here is the file resolution. If you'd like to change that, your JPEG quality and the, the color space for now, sRGB is fine for me. So I am going to click print to file. And here I can name my file appropriately and I can also select where I would like this photo to be saved and I'll hit save. Up here in the taskbar it's letting me know the, the progress. So let me pull up my finder window and Let's see, I had saved it in this folder, and you can see now that if I double click, it created a JPEG version of the photograph. Now, now that I see it enlarged, I see that it's a little bit out of focus, so I would go back and select a different photograph, but um, at least now you can see the process of creating a proof sheet.